Here we are again, guys. So we are going to react to the official teaser trailer for Shazam! No, I've been... <coughs> when I heard that they were coming out with this movie, it's like, perfect. This is going to be the most lighthearted movie in the DC Universe. I'm calling it now. And right now, so far, right now, Wonder Woman is the most, I guess, most hopeful movie of, of that. I mean, I I'm not going to call Wonder Woman lighthearted. I mean, well, it compared to the movies that we've had before, you know, hers, I mean, it, it's pushing towards where we would like for the DC Universe to be. Yeah. And Justice League did fall, did sort of carry on that torch a, a bit too. So this will be no exception. I don't, you know, because we it's based around kids, and and you choose a kid, and you give the kid superpowers, and he becomes this grown up demigod, you know, and yeah. So, Every kid's dream, basically. Yeah. So Billy Batson, be you know, basically gets to <laughs> experience. Billy Batson is that, that, that's name? that's his kid. That's the name Billy of the kid. Batson Billy Batson. Billy Badass. Billy ba <laughs> 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 yeah, um, yeah, he basically experiences what every kid basically has typically would dream of. Like, I just want to be a superhero. I just want superpowers. <coughs> so, I apologize. I have a cold. I forgot to say that. It's last okay. Year. She is like we're feeling um, we're, so, like miraculously a bit better. A bit, yeah. So Still stuffy though. Little, but yeah. So let's get right to this trailer. Okay. So our official teaser trailer to Shazam reaction starts right now. You've run from foster homes in six counties. I can take care of myself. Aww. When you're 18, give these people a chance. Because that's what they're giving you. This is Billy Batson. Ooh. Thanks for your making feel at home. They seem nice, but don't buy it. It gets real Game of Thrones around here. What? <clears throat> Dude. Just messing around. You look at me and you're like, why so dark? You're a disabled foster kid. You've got it all. <laughs> if you could have one superpower, what would you pick? Everybody chooses flight. You know why? So they can fly away from this conversation? No, because heroes fly. What, you need your fake family to stand up for you? Oh, I hate this guy. Oh, oh yes. Oh. Man, sorry about that. Sorry, oh, 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 I Get out the way. Billy Bats. What? Oh. I choose you as champion. Hell no. Get me off this Hello? train. Say my name so my powers may flow through you. But I don't know your name, sir. Shazam. Are you for real? Say, okay! Shazam? <laughs> What is happening? You're the only person I know that knows anything about this Cape Crusader stuff. Can I? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's crazy, right? What are your superpowers? Superpowers? Dude, I don't even know how to pee in this thing. <laughs> I'm a superhero. Insanely cute. See, I told you you were going to be on board. That looks very cute. <laughs> I mean, he is a kid who has never been a superhero he, in his life. The thing that I really like is that the guy, the adult yeah, exactly man me, but yeah. playing him yeah. is acting exactly like a kid would. Yeah, <laughs> exactly how a kid would when <laughs> they're given exactly superpowers. How That's how, how a kid would react. He's acting. It's just reality. That's how kids would react. Have you ever seen Big? 
Yeah, it, that the, reminds me so uh, much uh, of Big. Uh, big, right? That's what they're using. That's they use that maybe as inspiration. That's totally like I'm watching Big, but yeah, it's, it's a instead comic of, book movie. Instead of Josh, you know, like it's like you, they, uh, you know, they ask Tom Hanks, <laughs> Tom Hanks' yeah, character, Josh. They ask him, Josh, Hanks. and they and they said, Do you, "Would you be Superman?" And then this is, that's the combination. You no, know, this movie. I don't know if I like this. But the only thing is, it will not end with him take, giving his powers back, I don't think. He will it will stay with him, and he'll m mature over time, like where he'll learn the responsibilities of k being yeah. that powerful. But in, but, but in here... Well, in Big, he eventually learned how to be an adult. I mean, he did, and he did mature over time. Oh, oh yeah, uh-huh. <laughs> yeah. I don't <laughs> think Billy's going to go... And I don't think. That will be... Yeah, that will be really awkward yeah <laughs> if, if there's a grown woman is like ooh, hmm, shazam <laughs> yeah that was that was i always confused me i was but like this, uh, will, this will be funny a little weird this is i am looking forward to this movie you know i call in in the mcu where spider-man is just geeking out and all that stuff this is basically this for the dc universe yeah, this looks very cute. I will admit that. So imagine. I, guess, I don't know if I like his costume. That's how he's supposed to look. I know, but it looks a little weird. It looks a little. Like, I like it. It looks a little party city, but I don't know. Maybe <laughs> I, I like just, it. I, maybe I just have to like look, watch it. I don't know. Yeah, I I love it. I love it. And um. Like his muscles look fake to me, but I'm, I'm sure that they're not. I'm sure no, he's actually I mean, his, like his that. His body tone is pretty close to that. I'm pretty sure that he's just that jacked, but I mean, he mm -hmm. just isn't. I don't know. Hey, I, I buy into it. I mean, it's... I don't it's, know it's what a, he looks like It's a fun. Life, so. I mean, I mean, he was typically scrawny, and they made him hit the gym when he got this role. Okay. Yeah. I don't know. No offense to Zachary Levi, but I have no idea who he is. Well, you'll know who he is really well after this movie. Okay. He, I mean, he's been in a few things, like, um... Like some things I can't think of, but um, he was on he was on Chuck. He was he he was the lead. No, he he played Chuck on NBC. Oh yeah, that okay. was him from like years That's ago. That's probably why I'm not used to seeing him that yeah. big. Mm-hmm. And, and he this does and, look and, really cute. And he did play one of Thor's you know like uh, companions in the Thor sequels. He replaced um, Prince Charming from Once Upon a Time. He he took over him his role oh. because. I know, but he took, you know, he couldn't do it, but he filled in for that role in the okay. Thor movies. So he's one of the comrades, but he had blonde hair in that movie, so. But here, I'm I'm looking forward to it. I mean, this is how a kid would react. Yeah, yeah. And, and like, he's, like I said, he plays exactly how a kid would react in that situation. Mm -hmm. Like, he's acting like a kid. Right. I feel, I don't, I don't <laughs> I feel about like you guys. he's acting exactly like a kid but he's an adult this is, which is I mean, really funny what we see here is like the beginning stage of him experiencing his powers and just get, having fun with yeah. it but by the end of the movie I'm sure it will become serious and he'll right. he'll, he'll, he'll learn the responsibility you know it's a, yeah. it's a coming of age story and I I just they gotta have one moment where he forgets that he has to yell Shazam to change and people would ask well, what do we call you uh, uh, Shazam, and then psh, <laughs> then turns back into a kid, or if he says it by accident, like oh crap, I I, burnt, I just struck a hole through the through the roof. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, you know, like how in that moment in Green Lantern, like where I guess how Jordan showed his friend, you know, like when he ch changed into the suit, and they're geeking out like little kids. That fits better for this movie instead of that. Look how grown people can. I mean, true, but you know, it fits better with Billy and you know, and his and his buddy. I think it's cuter. Yeah. With the kids. Yeah, I mean, this is a kid story, basically. Yeah. And it's nice to see like kids acting and, like and kids. And just imagine how Shazam will react when he sees <coughs> Superman or any other of the members of the Justice League for the first <laughs> yeah. time. He's gonna I feel act, like it's gonna be like he's gonna be like, oh yeah. my god, oh my god, oh my god. I feel like he's gonna be like a little kid, like <laughs> yeah. a Toys R Us or something. Exactly. Well, not a Toys R Us anymore. Yeah. But and then they had the a theory. Story. Yeah. And they had a theory in the very first op the first scene in Justice League where kids were, at, you know, like talking to Superman. They were thinking, well, maybe that was one of Billy's friends that was talking to him. Maybe that was his friend there that was That'd talking to him. That would be a nice way to connect it. I like that, that they're would be all, cool. I like that they're trying to connect everything together. Uh -huh. Right. So, yeah, you know, like where's. Maybe they'll give us more like Justice League movies after the second one. Possibly. I won't, you know, I'm open to it. But yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward to this movie. 
So it's going to be a good way to start off spring next year. Mm -hmm. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed our reaction, thumb up the video, click subscribe, and click the bell icon so you can get notified when we upload new videos. And we'll see you guys in our next video. So peace out, guys. <laughs>